Rossini is an interdisciplinary project supported by Enail involving three partners, USA Pavia, the U Center Foundation, and the University of Milan. Its goal is the development of a risk-aware navigation platform for industrial plant workers who are exposed to multiple risks during natural hazard triggering technological disasters, or simply NATEC events. The Rossini platform does this by integrating two different risk identification and evaluation methods, structural and environmental, to create an overall risk map that can be navigated for safe worker egress. To collect the necessary input data, the Rossini platform acquires and analyzes data from different sensor technologies. Traditional accelerometers, fiber optic sensors and a meteorological station. The platform requires interaction between very several sensor architectures with differing sample rates, time for execution and results that need to be post-processed and correctly combined to give a final result. Identification of possible leakages from pipelines or vessels is a crucial aspect in this context. Here, a simplified analytical model was developed to analyze the discharge process of a pressurized vessel using pressure and temperature measurements from fiber optic sensors as input. The physical vulnerability of structures to earthquake shaking can be estimated and quantified via fragility functions. Knowing the structural and non-structural inventory of the industrial plant, a database of fragility functions can be established and utilized. Once a seismic event is detected via the sensor array, the risk of various damage states throughout the industrial plant can be estimated. These estimates can also be compared and verified with actual sensor measurements recorded at discrete locations. Similarly, with knowledge of potential leakages at these damage states, the diffusion of liquid or gas into the local environment can be simulated based on the meteorological conditions. This, in turn, can be utilized to estimate the associated impact on the health of the workers. By associating each structural and health risk with the relative scale of consequences and geospatially mapping these together, the overall risk map can be estimated instantaneously. The risk map is then communicated to the mobile client. The app computes the evacuation route that minimizes the risk. In this example, reaching the closest exit would require transiting in an area with high risk. Hence, an alternative longer but safer route is suggested. In an emergency situation, the user's vision can be impaired by smoke, for example. For this reason, in addition to showing the route on the map, the app also shows the direction to follow and provides navigation instruction in augmented reality. Rossini. Risk-aware navigation.